Your doctors are depending on a special band of unsung heroes to help them treat your cancer. At LLS, we call these heroes the Extraordinary League of Blood Cancer Tests. Today, we'll meet computed tomography, better known as the CT scan. If you're asked to have a CT scan, you may have questions like, what exactly is it? And why did my doctor order it? And what can I expect? So let's start with the first one. What exactly is a CT scan? A CT scan machine uses x-rays to create a series of pictures taken from different angles. When all the pictures are put together via computer, it creates three-dimensional images for your doctor to examine. Why might your doctor order this test? CT scans help doctors detect cancer or enlarged lymph nodes in the liver, pancreas, lungs, bones, and spleen. Your doctors may repeat this test over time so they can see how you're responding to your treatment. What can you expect? Well, before you get the test done, tell your doctor if you are pregnant or breastfeeding. They'll also want to know if you have any internal surgical devices like implants and metal hardware. You should also let your doctors know about any medications you are taking as they may want to adjust your medication schedule on the day of the test. The doctor may also ask you to refrain from eating. If you are anxious about the procedure, the doctor may give you a mild sedative or anti-anxiety medication to help keep you calm. What's the machine like? Enclosed machines look like a long tunnel open on both ends. It will be well lit and there will be an intercom so you can talk with the technician the whole time. On the day of the scan, you'll put on a hospital gown and will be asked to remove jewelry or accessories. Your technician may give you earplugs or headphones so you can listen to your favorite music. You'll be asked to lie down and the technician will position you and then slide you into the machine. You'll hear a loud series of knocks and noises throughout the test. You may be asked to hold your breath for up to 30 seconds. Remember, it is very important that you remain still. The good news though, while the test is really loud, it doesn't hurt at all. Then, they will likely give you what's called a contrast medium, either by mouth, by injection, or by enema. The contrast medium will make certain organs and tissues show up more clearly on the scan. A few minutes after you take the contrast medium, they'll perform another scan. The scan itself only takes about 10 to 30 minutes. Once the test is over, you'll slide out of the machine, and you're done. Now, CT scans will give your doctors a much better picture of what's happening with your cancer, especially in your lymph nodes. And the more they know, the better treatment they'll be able to provide. And, as always, the CT scan, along with the rest of the extraordinary league of blood cancer tests, will always be there to bravely light the way on your journey towards recovery.